Hey guys, I uh, just wanted to check in with you on this uh, lovely day here. Um, just getting ready to uh, start filming a few more projects uh, when we got hit with a, uh, what would I guess would be the first big snowstorm of the uh, year. Uh, we are expecting anywhere between 35 and 50 uh, centimeters of snow, uh, but that could go uh, more. Um, so yeah, we're just hanging out here in the garage. Uh, just thought I'd uh, show you some of the weather that we're having. So, a couple of projects here in the garage we'll talk about in a second. Uh, but I just want to open the door here and let you have a look at what's going on outside. So it's uh, not terrible right now. Uh, we've had, had a bit of uh, snowfall, but not, not too much yet. Uh, we spent most of yesterday actually rebuilding that tarp shed that's uh, right there. Uh, that blew down about two, I want to say about a, two weeks ago, three weeks ago. Maybe longer, actually probably closer to a month ago. Uh, that blew down in a, in a winter storm we had, uh, but uh, it was just wind and rain. Uh, it ended up actually getting pitched up on top of that deck there. Anyway, um, so yeah, we ended up uh, fixing that up and rebuilding it with some uh, some better materials. Um, and then we also cleaned up the yard in preparation for the, uh, the impending weather. So we actually moved a few of our uh, cold storage vehicles uh, to where they are now. Uh, my van and a friend of ours, uh, Red Golf. We also built this lovely wood shed uh, to store some of our lumber uh, that we have to uh, burn in the uh, garage, keep us warm during the winter. Uh, and as well down the back 40, you can see we have uh, long-term tire storage, so we moved all of our tires down there uh, again before the, uh, the snow hits and it uh, makes getting down there almost impossible. And then in the driveway, uh, we have my daily, which is a, a 2010 uh, TDI Touareg, which I'll probably end up doing a video on. Uh, we've done some body work to it, we've done uh, a fair bit of work on it actually, uh, but it's just my usual day-to-day -day driver. Uh, we also have a parts uh, Jetta, uh, sorry, uh, Jetta uh, diesel that we're going to use for another project that's coming up, uh, as well as uh, our buddy Paul's old A3, uh, which uh, he was nice enough to, to donate to the channel. Uh, and we'll see uh, his new rig, uh, hopefully in upcoming videos, uh, we'll be doing some timing guides and things like that on his new A4. And then of course you have my daily, other daily, which is my 2002 Golf, uh, which is uh, lifted and has a Jetta front end. Uh, and of course, you always have to have the recreational vehicle. That's my uh, 1999 uh, 350 Yamaha Big Bear Millennium Edition. So it's got the fancy rims, allegedly. Anyway, it's a great bike. I really, I really enjoy it. It's uh, served me well the last three years that I've owned it. And we're going to go back inside because it is freezing outside. And uh, yeah, we're going to get more of that, uh, that snow short. So here we have, uh, speaking of snow, we have a few things that we're working on. Uh, we have two snow blowers here. Uh, one is uh, mine, uh, and the other one is a parts rig. And then the one in the back there is Sean's. Uh, yeah, so we're just, we had them here to just do some cleaning up on them, tuning up on them. Uh, we're actually going to take some of the uh, systems off this guy here. Um, are actually going to be moved over to my current snowblower, so I'm going to get the, the power head and get the light and the controls moved over to mine, uh, as well as the auger, or not the auger, sorry, the shoot controls on this unit are in a lot better shape than mine, and it has a um, movable spout where mine is is manual. I have to uh, move it by hand, which is somewhat inconvenient. And then, of course, I'm sure some of you are wondering what this other rig is here in the uh, in the garage itself. This is a 2010, I think, 2011, uh, City, no, not City, sorry, uh, Volkswagen Golf Sport Wagon, I guess, or Golf Wagon, I don't know what they call them. It's, I think they call them Jetta Sport Wagons, too. Anyway, it's um, a future project, which we're probably going to do a video on relatively soon. We're going to get it uh, in tip-top shape, probably bring it up to Volkswagen for a paint warranty claim, if we can get one. And yeah, we're just going to get it all uh, set up for her. It's uh, got a 2.5 liter five cylinder gas engine in it uh, with the uh, Tiptronic uh, automatic transmission. Uh, it's got a decent head unit. Uh, it's very well equipped, actually. I'm very impressed with it. It's got lots of heated thing, options, heated seats, heated rear windows, uh, nice alloy wheels. Uh, just needs uh, a bit of love. The uh, As you can kind of see there in the video, the... Uh, 
rear is uh, sagging in both ends. Uh, both rear coil springs are cracked off, and I think we might have one front coil spring cracked off. Anyway, uh, Paul's A3 that's out there is going to be a donor for most of the parts for this rig, as they're a common platform, and some of the parts are interchangeable. So we're going to utilize everything we can off that for uh, this build. Anyway, guys, just wanted to catch up to date with what's going on today uh, in the garage and uh, here in our little slice of heaven we call Newfoundland. Um, yeah, so if you guys uh, always remember to like and subscribe, uh, make sure to hit the bell for the notifications, you know, what all the other YouTubers ask you to do. And uh, yeah, we'll uh, catch you all in the next video. And if you want to throw a comment down in the comment section, please free, feel free to do so. And have a fantastic, uh, fantastic day. Thanks, guys. Cheers.